Hey everybody, today's video is sponsored by TuneSkit iOS System Recovery. This software is both available for Windows and for Mac. You can just click the link in the description and you will land here. Then click free trial and you can try the software before you can buy it. This software fixes or repairs 150 plus iOS problems on iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch and Apple TV. You can check out the issues listed here like uh, white Apple logo, if your device is stuck in recovery mode, black screen, boot loop screen, frozen screen, or if your device is stuck in headphone mode, you can also fix it. You can also fix if your device is stuck with a restore failure or update failure, a lock screen, a blue screen, and so on. This software can fix your device without any data loss. So it is a really good software for that. This software has two modes. Number one is the standard mode, which can fix common iOS problems without data loss. And they have given you the advanced mode that can fix serious iOS issues, but this will erase all data. This software can also fix iTunes errors and you can use this to enter or exit recovery mode easily. You can also check out the sale going on for Christmas and New Year with up to 85% off if you purchase this app bundle, which has different software from this company. You also have 65% off with iOS system recovery plus iPhone data recovery with only $59.95 right now. I have already downloaded the software and installed it. So let's see how it works. All right, so guys, you can check out that this software can fix all these problems. It can fix 150 plus iOS issues as I have stated earlier. You can check out the warning here that if your device has an hardware failure, this will not be fixed with this software and your device will be updated to the latest version after it is repaired. So simply click start here. For this video, we will use standard mode. With standard mode, repairing iOS system won't cause any data loss. Click next. And now select your device, iPhone 7 Plus, iPhone 8 or later, Apple TV, Apple TV HD. So I am using iPhone 6 for this tutorial. So I will select all other devices. Now you have to put your device into DFU mode. You can check out the instructions right here and it will do it for you. Or you can also put your device into recovery mode by following the instructions. So I will quickly put my device into recovery mode now. My device is now in recovery mode and you can check out that the next button is now available. Now it has detected my device automatically iPhone 6 on 12.5.5. You can also download the firmware. Just copy it from here and then paste it into the browser and download it. You can also select the firmware from your computer if you have downloaded it already or when you click the download button, it will download it from you. So I have downloaded the software for my device already so just click select now select the IPSW click open and it will start verifying the firmware package so it is near completion now it has verified it successfully just click repair the repair process will now start it will unzip the firmware now now guys it will start fixing the iOS on your device all right, guys, you can see your repair completed. Now your device will boot and you will be brought to the home screen normally without any data loss. Now click done. Now guys, if you want to subscribe to their channel, the link is in the description. You can check it out. That's all for this video. If you have any question, please ask in the comment section. I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye guys.